Yo, hey guys, how's it going? It's Soul Calibur coming at you with a Pokin Tournament DX video. I've got two replays to show you guys against uh, various people using my Gardevoir, which is uh, now B rank, which is good. And uh, yeah, there's still people playing the Wii U version, funnily enough. Like, there's not many people on ranked, so it's, you know, the I mean, there are people playing, it's just there's not as much as there is on the Wii U, I suppose, and like people still don't have Switches, so it's another problem. But, you know, it's it's, it's so good, trust me, you guys should get it, it's amazing. Anyways, uh, I'm against this C3 rank sizzle there, and um, he needs to. Okay, the, the first thing I need to point out is that he needs to stop counter attacking because Gardevo has a field phase move that can pierce people at range, and that that can also come up for a follow-up although now he does get a, uh, a counter attack in and I need to be wary of that so uh, you know just basically going for down down uh, downwards X or 2x that uh, people tend to use notations like computer notations you know 4 means backwards and 6 means forward instead of using back Y or forward Y I don't know how people respond to it but in the Pokemon community most people use notations Anyway, so I failed to punish the Ambion call there, and now I'm basically trying to see if I can get in. Thanks to Frogadio, I'm able to uh, get back into neutral, but unfortunately I let Rip and Moonblast, and he goes for a U-turn. So that actually cost me the first round there. But uh, yeah, let's get into the second round anyway. So, uh, the good thing about Gardevoir is that uh, she can now cancel Moonblast. You'll see later in the video, I'll, sh I'll point it out when it happens. But yeah, uh, basically what Gardevoir couldn't do in the Wii U version was cancel Moonblast. It had, once you let it go, it always went off. But now you have an option to stop Moonblast coming out before, before, um, like fully, like you, when you use Moonblast, Gardevoir, Gardevoir mains will know this. When you let go of Moonblast, you have this ring of energy in front of you and then you see the beam come out just like it did just now. But uh, in the, in Pokemon Tournament DX, you can now cancel the Moonblast into a grab. So, um, yeah, again, when it comes out, I'll, I'll let you know. Okay, so here I'll go for a jump in X. I've managed to get rid of the... No, not get rid of it. What am I saying? I managed to stuff his counter attack, but unfortunately, the stored power into Magical Leaf doesn't knock him out, but he was pressing a button at the last instant, so I catch that, and I managed to take out the round. But yeah, uh, again, he needs to stop counter attacking at range. <laughs> like, I don't know why he... I don't know why he need, he's doing that. Like, it's just... Yeah. Anyways, uh, shoot Moonblast again to dual phase, and he's throwing swords out where my energy ball is in play, which is not a good thing for him because my energy ball defuses on projectiles. Right, so just making sure that I, well, I, was, I thought he'd jump there, but he managed to catch me with the bullet punch follow up. Right, so we're in dual phase again. Good thing about Moonblast is it acts like a shield of, of some sorts, like you saw just there. It's um, it took out, it nullified the the big claw attack and then counter attacked him in return. But yeah, uh, he gets caught in my stored power and I finish him off. So that's the first game. Okay, so going into the second game, it's against a Charizard of the same rank. So yeah, let's get into it. Right, so I'm actually talking at around half past one in the morning and I, I live in the UK. So. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm, I'm a night owl. I'm, I'm a night decidue, so... <laughs> I, I don't sleep very early sometimes. I, I like staying up late for some reason. It's a habit. I need to stop doing that. But yeah, uh, I wanted to record this at around 10 o'clock, but I, I wasn't feeling it, and I really wanted to eat, so... I thought, wait until it gets late at night, do like a chill commentary sort of thing, and, it's just, and then, yeah, just go for it. And yeah, uh... Moonblast is weird because it's kind of like a lingering hitbox. It's got, it's got quite a lot of active frames, than people might realise. So they might not shield sometimes. So yeah, uh, another case of people being impatient, and because of that, you get perfected. That's what happens if you don't be patient. You get hit by lots of things on throwing out, and then yeah. Uh, same way again from the first round, he gets hit by a. Uh, six wine, no, six. Is it? It's two wine field, but it's kind of like it's weird. The, the notations are weird when it when it uh, changes in between phases. The notations are weird, but yeah, 
Alright, so I throw a store power just in the hope that I can like at least cancel the neutral that Frogadio gave out. And he got too close, so I'm not gonna go for a uh, a burst declare. And yeah, here it is. That's where you can cancel Moonblast into grab. And it's so good. Like, it's so amazing. Like, it's really good. Like, I've caught a lot of people with that move anyway. <laughs> But yeah, uh, that's the replays. I've got another two for another video, so I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll catch you again later. Peace.